I get to talk about the NHL almost every day, and that's pretty fun. But I usually like to pick, like, one story and follow that. Do a video on that. So today's story that I'm following is, oh my god, there's so many stories! Information just hit me like, whoa! <laughs> uh, Alright, where do we start? Okay, well in case you missed it, Dennis Wideman of the Calgary Flames drilled a linesman from behind. What's even more amazing is there's an actual legitimate debate to it. Because Wideman got smashed into the boards just moments before, and it was unclear as to whether or not he actually knew what he was doing because he looked groggy. The footage is insane, and you can find it on sportsnet.ca as well as all the other stories I'm going to talk about. Like for example, did I mention there was another ref who got clobbered? Milan Lucic, you know that guy's tough. You know his fire burns hot and he's in the middle of a scrum with the Colorado Avalanche. He goes to throw a punch and pops an official right in the chops. Official actually took it pretty well, I gotta say. And he probably wasn't that amused about it at the time, but he could look at all his buddies and go, you know, I took a Milan Lucic punch right to the chops. He doesn't punch that hard. He doesn't, nah, it's fine. It's nothing. And of course the NHL All-Star Game is coming up this weekend. I'm sure you already know that. Yeah, yeah. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Did you know that the Metro Division's captain, Alex Ovechkin, bailed on the game? Yep. He's not gonna be there and is apparently gonna miss the All-Star Game with injury. Now I put injury in quotes because this wouldn't be the first time that a player is like, yeah, I'm just not going to go to the All-Star game. But according to Elliot Friedman, the Washington Capitals really wanted to give Ovechkin some time off and they accept the one game penalty and why not? They're in the middle of a cup race. Yeah, yeah. Did I mention one of the captains from last year, Jonathan Taves, is bailing on the game too? Yeah, that's right. Jonathan Taves will not be at the 2016 All-Star game in Nashville. However, he will be replaced by Nashville forward James Neal. Ovechkin, by the way, is going to be replaced by his teammate Evgeny Kuznetsov. As long as we're talking about who will and won't be at the NHL All-Star Game, John Scott. So fun fact, they're selling NHL All-Star Game shirts for John Scott on NHL.com. Today is Thursday. The game is four days from now on Sunday. And his shirts are sold out. Uh, yeah, he's a little popular. And he has gotten even more popular because holy smokes, did you read the bombshell that he dropped? John Scott wrote this huge thing for the Players' Tribune and was basically like, all right, so here's how I saw my career coming as a hockey player. I didn't actually think it was going to make it to the NHL and then I finally did and then I got voted into the All-Star Game and I was concerned considering not going to the All-Star Game, and then I said, screw it, I'm going. What else we got? Anthony Sorelli named the new captain of the Oshawa Generals. Oshawa, I live there! Which, by the way, the CHL Top Prospects game is tonight, and that'll be on Sportsnet. And by the way, that'll be Team Cherry, as in Don Cherry, against Team Orr, as in Bobby Orr. What else did I miss? Oh, it's also American Hockey League All-Star Weekend, and then that's gonna be happening too. Just reading that LA is supposed to get the next All-Star Game. It's happening as I'm shooting this thing. It's not even that long. And oh, look at that email I got while in the middle of shooting this. Apparently, Dennis Weidman has been suspended until after the All-Star game. Heck, all right, I'm gonna edit and upload this thing before anything else happens. So we're not gonna get any NHL games for the next few days. That's because it's the All-Star weekend. That much is obvious. But I think I'm gonna need those few days just to catch up on everything that's been happening. Of all those stories that I mentioned, what do you think is the biggest right now? And what do you think about them? What do you think about John Scott said? What do you think about Ovechkin and Taves not going to the All-Star game? What do you think about Weidman, that whole Weidman incident? People are still freaking out about that. I don't know what to think about anything. So I don't think at all. Smart.